Emperor Giorgio's Tea Room. It's both our name and one of our favorite characters' names from the uh, Star Trek show, uh, Star Trek Discovery. It's just sort of like an escape from the outside world. Like, it's not just you're coming getting a cup of tea. Like, it's a whole experience. Like, you're coming for the decor, we're coming for the great service. You're coming for a meal, really. It's kind of a fancy high tea experience, but you can come in t-shirt and jeans. We wanted to have people feel accepted and represented in our tea room as well, and feel safe. We're definitely known for our scones, and then we have about 30 different teas people can choose from. So there's something for everyone. It's just a great neighborhood to walk around. There's Poe's Shines, long-standing great soul food place. Oregon Contemporary is an art center in North Portland, and we have exhibitions, we have events with partner organizations, we put on performances, photos, paintings, drawings. We really strive to be a welcoming space for everyone and for people to feel like they can come here with friends and family and hang out. We love being in Kenton and it's a really special neighborhood. I go to Posey's like every week. Woo is also great. We're a metaphysical boutique. We also do resale. People see the sign and they come in and they're like, I know what this is. I love the name of your shop. Like this is where I'm supposed to be. It's tarot cards and crystals and channeling and mediumship and meditation. I just want people to come here and like feel safe and feel curious and want to come back. I don't sell anything in here that I can't explain with like a relative amount of confidence. I love this little neighborhood. I was at Mantle yesterday. We focus on housewares, locally made, but also goods coming from all over the world things that we have specifically curated from maybe Spain or the Netherlands. We have glassware that was made just a couple blocks away. The record store is really great, Spex Records. We have some awesome thin sliced pizza by Pizza Fino that's right across the street. Ken is such a small little community. It feels like a small town in a bigger city, and you have the advantages of both. <laughs> we are on the land that formerly housed the community of Vanport City and was the home for many, many people from various cultures throughout the United States. Vanport Mosaic is a memory activism project, capturing the stories and the memories of people who were part of this community. We capture all of this life in a festival that we have every year. There are exhibits. What makes Kenton special as a neighborhood is that it too holds a variety of cultures and peoples. 